Does anyone else like second chances? Because we're giving the Atreides a second chance here after my last beating at the hands of the Fremen. We are gonna look, have fun. Feo says this is his first game. All right, Feo. All right, boys, so is Rice and Bean. We love new gamers. All right, might be a, might be a chiller game this time around then. Rice and Beans and Feo. So we got Doghead on the Smugglers. We got Rice and Beans on the Ekaz, and we got Feo on House Vernius. Some new blood in the community. This is just a, a random Discord game we threw together. A couple of boys jumped in for their first games. Good on you. Show me what you've got. Oh, wow, we are like in the center of the map. That's sort of an odd spawn there. Sort of an odd spawn there. Here, we'll stick our rally point way out there. Look at this. Boom, we land right next to the village. Amazing. Listening. Get to work, everybody. Yes, sir. Fire at will. <laughs> and we'll set the rally point back down there because I don't like I don't really like sure, people sir. landing in weird spots. We're playing yeah, some right. uh, we're playing some some Lady Jessica today. We're gonna try and remember to use ceasefires. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> I don't often play Jessica, so I sort of forget that that's a thing that I can do, right? Can pop open the old uh, force truce option on people through the diplomacy tree, force them to uh, to make peace with you. They can always betray that if they want to, but betrayals are pretty savage. You get a bad, you get a bad spice rate. You lose like 200, 250 Landsrad. You. Uh, the people that you betrayed get a damage bonus against you. I think it's all that stuff. It's pretty savage. I should probably use it more often. I, I generally, I'm not a huge Jessica fan because uh, I typically feel like she just kind of buys you a little bit of time when she doesn't necessarily stop stuff from happening. What do we got here? We got some rare elements below us. I'm really hoping we got some minerals over here in Adda. I really like early minerals. Nope, we got energy source. Where are my minerals? We are devilishly close. This is like the middle right here, isn't it? Yes, oh my god, go look at that. Is that okay, the middle right there? Go. We got a very forward spawn. It Blue. is freaking wild, okay. We are one step out from the middle. What are we grabbing? I guess we're grabbing towards the middle. Unfortunately, the village is way down there. I'd much or the the sink village is way down there. I'd much rather it was uh, a bit closer to us, but what are you gonna do? We are gonna be uh, in a somewhat exposed position. This game it looks like not nestled safely back into the corner, but we'll manage. Drag these guys back a little bit. Make sure they're in range of our main base. Yes, Easy peasy, we get our harvesters harvesting. Let's check some traits. Cheaper building costs, 20% more resource production. That's pretty good. We like that. That's a good one. We are focused. Here we go down here. This village down here is one plaz for economy building and three free water. Ready. Those are not too exciting. And we've got a Moondu Vale next to us. Moondu Vale's not a very Please. good special region in the grand scheme of things. It is special Away in its command. own way Let's go. Hmm. okay 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 over there we got sandfall which is much better yes, understood. make sure we're position. grabbing grabbing some goodies on the map when we're not fighting militia I think we'll grab ourselves a heavy weapon squad oh we got a nice pretty quick um, spice field down there we don't hate a quick double spice we're gonna be yeah, well, the good news is we got a lot, of, a lot of room behind us to expand to, so we've got that going. We've got the front lines secured pretty quickly. <laughs> Again, sort of unfortunate that the village spawned way over there. If it would have spawned right here, it would have been the safest place in the world to take, but way on that side, less safe for sure. At your service, sir. Um, I think you the troops will prep to take that sir. spice field is the All next move. plan. And I am waiting for my agent before I could take this. I've got, uh, we've got the young Paul Atreides today, so we're gonna be searching, we're gonna use this to reveal a siege right away and try and get some siege alliances up. 
Come on, come on. Any second now, I should get an agent, and that'll unlock our uh, point of interest stuff. This guy is a Plas Creek guy. Research that point of interest. Eight days. It's gonna take forever. I think we're good to go, and we'll take. Mm, yeah, we're fine. We're fine. It's a bit of a walk. We just gotta make sure that the heavy weapon squad doesn't start the festivities. We are, we're gonna invest in Plascrete down here as well, since we don't have those uh, really minerals to work with. <clears throat> we'll have money, uh, but not a lot of Plascrete. That's something. Only two wind there, you hate to see it. Maybe you get a recruitment office, at least in the short term. Okay, what do we see? What do you find behind us, Thopters? What's back there? Anything good? Maybe we'll prep a probe setup and we'll keep an eye out for any raiders. We got smugglers already over there. Smugglers being Doghead, the, the other veteran in the lobby, so we gotta keep an eye on him for sure. Uh, I think we're gonna... I think we're gonna aim for sort of a, uh, a wide... I think we're gonna aim for something like a wide hedge type victory is the plan for this game. Um, which is only gonna work if we get some proper RNG, the, if the random number generator takes, takes pity on us and lets us uh, have some sieges to ally with for our boy Paul. Oh, there's one. Raider coming right out of here. here to deal with the the right around, I feel like it's right around day 20. Day 18, 19, 20, 21. I think you ought to zoom out, keep your eyes on the wide picture, and look for raiders spawning. That seems to be about the timing of it. Deer to minor houses, pillaging and sieges, all factions suffer. Mm, we don't love any of these, really. We're going to oppose that. That would be bad for everybody, but I'm part of everybody. <laughs> I feel like uh, smugglers will spring for this, but Vernius might grab it for themselves. If they know what they're doing, Vernius will grab this. No, Ekaz took it. Okay, interesting. Should have done that, Vernius. Dog had spent all his influence on it because he wants it. But if you're a pillage in Ekaz, no shame in grabbing it for yourself. We are ready. Let's, um. How long a walk is it to get up there? They got four guys in it. What about. Okay, so we'll wait for the scan to show us this before we claim this. Because we don't want to claim this and have it show us that it's in the place we already scanned. Don't click on that. Don't do it, Davok. I do it all the time. There it is. Got a guy up here, 20% building upkeep reduction. Oh, it's a good one. All right, how about another siege? Where's siege number two? Way over there. On a spice field. No, he is a spice trader. We'll make some trades with him, but that one will be a harder sell because that's smuggler territory. Yes, sir. Um, can we peacefully annex that and save the trouble of walking up there and fighting people? That's a reasonable thought. That's a reasonable thought. I like it. Let's lean down our green tree and we'll throw the peaceful annex up there. I think we want some siege alliances sooner rather than later. What is this guy doing? 20% economy resource production on the spice field. You love to see it. We've had some good, uh, some good luck on the spice fields there. We'll sell a little bit more. We got a ton of spice. We got we tons ready. of spice. It's looking good on the spice production f front. We are listening. What's that? The desolation in the back, that's a shame. We don't want that at all. We would rather that be on a border somewhere when the backfield is just, just trouble. 
2500 hegemony means we need to start building some major buildings. Meaning we gotta start saving up the plascrete. Oh, the plascrete's so tight. It really sucks not to have a... Uh... Oh, well, the riches is good. But oh, look at this. All of the villages spawn like as far away from my territory as possible, making those really, really awkward. This one we like. It's right next to all of our other stuff, but those ones that I kind of want are a little distant. Just some unfortunate spawns there. Is it nighttime? Do I just walk up and shoot them? Never mind. We'll walk over and we'll shoot them. It'll save some time. Atreides' uh, military is pound for pound pretty tough, so you win a four, four troops versus four militia, no problem. We are cutting it close with the water, though. That is a, a, a concern. Being at nighttime will we'll suck up less water, but uh, it's not ideal. These are weaker troops. We might be able to cut through them in time. It was a risk to, to take, for sure. Let's make sure we focus fire. We should be all right. Yep, we should be fine. Get more guys in Arrakis. This guy is a Solari per information level. Don't hate that. Yeah, like Trady's troops are so tough, they're just cutting through. No problem. No problem. Doghead has taken Sandfall up there. I really wanted that one. We will stick a heavy militia up in that village just to make sure we don't get quickly pillaged yes, by him for some. I mean, we've got a spice field back there. That's what I was hoping to see in the backfield some spice. We may just not even take Moondu Valley. Keep that in our back pocket. We got mountains and then a desert, but there's a little bit of space to squeak through. Just an empty little little village there. Weird. It's kind of a weird map. Kind of a weird map for sure. We got this is another two wind. <laughs> the wind doesn't love us today. 20% on the economy buildings. I guess we'll stick some wholesale markets out and about. Um, and this guy in here seems like he might be a maintenance center kind of guy. But first, let's prioritize the processing plant up top. Is this useful? This is some fire stuff. Some fire stuff. The energy sources over here is Plascrete with a little money per Plascrete buildings. Up there is a space cruiser wreck. That's yes. gonna be probably another doghead one, if I had to if I had to bet. If I was a betting man. That's okay. Service, We're not there's a, a forward spice over Ready. there too. It depends we'll see if maybe we can steal that forward spice. We'd love to be a four spice Atreides. We would really, really like that. that maintenance center up that I was talking about. What's this quest? Kill militia for a free warden. Alright. Let's go just murder some militia. We can't pillage anything, but that doesn't mean we can't murder. And we need to save up Plascrete for another main base Waiting building. Command. We need to think about what we're going to take next. Probably this spice field is my next take. Foliage right there. That's the Ekaz lands. They're going to... So that gives them a pretty good claim on the Well of Riches. Oh, got a ranger out here getting getting shot. Need to take aggro off him by engaging. All good, all good. Kill that guy and then everyone walk home. We are we are really light in the water at the moment. We got a two wind, a four wind, a two wind. Yeah, boy. We might do an insulated valley sooner rather than later. I think we modular parts because we got some good spice going. We want to get more harvester crew out and about. What's this guy? What's this guy? Two intel of one building of each type. I'm here for it. A little bit of intel would be fine. Here to deal with the heavy stuff. We're listening. I think we uh, heal the folks up. Boy, we need some water. Ooh, the water's gonna be tricky. I wanna go fight this place, but we're so low on the water, I don't even know if I could do it, even though it's right next to me.
Mm-hmm. Lands are at standing or manpower. We're, st we're still the Atreides, so we've got the premier influence growth thanks to that early development, so we get our pick. Do I want money or manpower or standing? <clears throat> hmm. What do I want? I guess we want the money. Mo money is always good. That's got Harkonnen taint on it. Standing is fine. Yeah, we'll take the money. We'll take the money and run. Probably didn't need quite that much on the money, but there it is. Ready. We're wealthy. Let's go. But thirsty. So thirsty. Wealthy but thirsty. You better win this fight, heavy militia. I expect you to beat that raider. But you never know these days. You never know. Oh, actually, we don't want this blue building. We're gonna do this blue building. The old Concord Chamber to boost our speed up in Katar. Feo says, the eternal Vernius problem. How do I draw this line? <laughs> I feel you, man. Yes, the Vernius sir. lines are tricky we'll for me as well. Ready. we'll take uh, it's, it's nighttime. We'll try and rush over there while they while the getting is good. On duty. Once again, we like nighttime because it gives you that night buff, which is a lowered supply drain. So your supplies will stretch a little bit further. Less likely for everyone to die of thirst. Get ourselves a free yes, warden. It's the right move. I think well, we should win this fight just fine, thanks to the uh, super yes, boss, Trades military. Boom. All good. And we can build in our main base. We are gonna build an embassy to get that early standing cooking. And maybe we'll. We'll try and make. Oh, we don't got the influence for it, but we'll try and make friends with House Vernius. So we could have their tech, trade them some stuff. Yes, sir. I like that thought. <clears throat> Getting closer, closer, closer. We would love that alliance. This is Spicefield. Oh, we spent all of our Plascrete already, though. Need to blow something up? Um, okay, okay, okay. Maybe... Listen, if Ekaz isn't going to take this, we're going to go take that. Dare I snag? That mid's been pillaged. But look at this. If you could take this base and this base and this base, you could do a nice little uh, tri-state area of missile batteries there. Ooh, I like that thought. We salute you. I like that thought. Well, that makes me excited. Sir. Tickles me on the inside a little bit. Let's pull up another... Another heavy weapons squad in the meantime. <clears throat> Meanwhile, diplomatic maneuvers and and chome integration. Rice and beans wants a treaty. Dare I treaty with the beans? I have no I will. Because of that I'm gonna walk up, I'm gonna try and take this uh this place Not that you probably need. want. Yes, sir. But we're still so low on water. Only three winds. Oh my goodness. I guess we'll have to build a couple of three wind water collectors. As painful as that is. Almost got that alliance up up top. That will be good. Make sure we are grabbing some good We're points of interest. It's the right move. <laughs> Maybe I can, oh yeah, let's do it. Let's peacefully annex it. He won't, he'll never see it coming. Oh, the Atreides way. And let's get this alliance going. 20% cheaper building upkeep, don't mind if I do. Give me some of that chome. Give me them chome shares at 500 bucks. Losing money not to buy the chome shares at 500 bucks. It's going good. We got a, a really solid economy cooking here. I feel good about, let's, Toss a couple, toss up some militia at each spot. What do you need? Um, let's get a new base in our base, a new building in the base. Maybe a fast research center. We'll destroy it later on. People were preaching to me about the uh, the benefits of an early research center. 
I usually like them for the end game hedge push, but people are saying, no, you build them early, you soak up that extra knowledge, that extra hedge game, and then when you get to the point where you look like you're being, you might be a little dangerous on your, your hedge total, and you destroy it, and boom, it drops you back down, but you've gotten a bunch of free stuff in the meantime. I think there's some value to that thought, so we'll try that out. Um, I think I'd like an airfield up here. We need we need some way to get there fast, and this guy gets a uh, plus ten bucks for having one building of each color. So I'm happy to do that. We'll go, sir. Keep an eye on the ECAS. Oh, that's a spice field over there too, and this is the Imperial Basin. Oh, ho, 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 ho. I want to steal those things. Vernius is patenting stuff. Am I still light in the I'm still too light in the Lanzar to even try to, to piece him. He's patented Chome integration. Alright, I'll pay you for it. Cut it out with that patented bullshit. Village capture failed. No, the ECAs are taking that. And this has got a purple line through it. Maybe we save up and we we try like a triple peaceful annex. Th 119, 138, 133. I like that. I like that thought. I like that thought. 119, 138, 133, 260, 271, 380, 390. Save up to 390 authority and then boom, peaceful annex this whole thing at once, insta-build missile turrets there so nobody can touch it. That sounds like fun. We're gonna do that. Oh, look how close we are. We got foliage right here. They're a little further set back, but uh, our smuggler friends also spawned pretty close. They're, I guess they're two regions back from the middle. I'm just one skinny little region Hi, out. Let's fill up these spice crews, get them on safe mode so they don't get eaten anymore. We're still lacking the Plascrete. 83 is not enough. I like over a hundred Plascrete income is my comfort zone. None of these matter at all to me. I do not care. I think I don't want all factions gain hedge per controlled region. I wish I could see who had controlled regions. I don't think I have taken any yet. We're going to pose this. At least a hundred. That's a minor houses one, so they get ten votes. Uh, yeah. We should probably put more into it, but it, I feel like smugglers might want it. No, Ekaz and Vernius wanted it. Interesting. Smugglers sat on their votes. They threw fifty into approved there. Hmm, curious. All right, all right. Let's get uh, let's get the manpower building up there. Might need that sooner rather than later. With our aggressive expansion plans here. Did this guy? Yes, that guy got eaten too. Does this guy? Oh, this guy and I never even built my uh, thing over here. Totally forgot about that. This is a spice field. I think, as much as I like to keep the extra authority around, I think we need the Plascrete. Because we don't... So these are the things that let you pay Plascrete to get authority, or or you could just grab Plascrete from them. I think I'm just going to grab Plascrete from them, because I don't got enough Plascrete to pay them, so I might as well do something with them before someone else gets them, right? That's my thoughts. We got a big old, big old army of suboids for our bo our boy Feo down there. And we got what we wanted over there. Let's get some red tech cooking. <laughs> I think we want a political entente eventually. But in the short term, let's get some water. And some 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 red tech so that we could fight for stuff. Because we are closing in. What did we say? We wanted 390 to take all these? It's actually it's cheaper because we get a discount. Oh yeah, yeah. Look at this. Your cultural assimilation says you get minus authority and influence cost to peaceful annex. 
So it's actually 96, 111, 11, yeah, it's, it's just barely 300, really. Ooh, cool, cool, cool. We can do it even sooner than we thought. That is the plan. We want to make sure... Okay, we got the urban planning up. That lets us build stuff simultaneously, so that's important. We can grab this gift to make sure we've got enough influence to do so, and then we will we will try our little plan. That makes me that makes me happy. It's a fun little plan. As long as someone doesn't try and take stuff or pillage stuff in the meantime. Where's my guy's dying? Why is this guy down there? Oh my god, what is it? He's lost. He got lost. I just lost two guys. Did I accidentally move guys down there when I wasn't paying attention? Holy crap. Troopers down. Heavy weapon squads down. I must have sent guys out there when I wasn't looking. Ay, caramba. That's no good. My dude's just wandering out into the desert. Wayward Atreides trooper. It's true. Very wayward. Mm, let's, uh, we need a little bit of money. We should probably be stockpiling. We should pay more attention to these chome rights. We gotta build more men. We don't want, uh, we don't want Doghead coming in and causing trouble with us. We you. Certainly now that we lost a third of our army, we just Let's miss queuing or something. Okay. We do need more money, though. Is there any money to be had? To you walk out into that desert and then come back. <laughs> I'm sure it'll be fine. All right, let's start it. Let's start the plan. Peaceful annex. Peaceful annex. Peaceful annex. <laughs> Nine days left, and you shall be mine. Yes, sir. Listen, everyone's walking out there. Why is everyone walking out there? I didn't want Away everyone to walk out there. Ooh, I do want to reveal service, more sieges, sir. though. Maybe if we we're lucky, there's a siege over here. And that would be even even more good, Bennies. <clears throat> but we're going to piss people off here, so we need soldiers. We need soldiers as soon as possible. On duty. You yes, guys sir. fall back into there. We'll switch over to our airfield turned on so we can see where our airfields are. We're not particularly spread out, so we're reasonably comfortable still. This guy, I think, will make it home without dying. <laughs> I sure hope so. <laughs> he was sent on a suicide mission into the desert. I can be a Do you want to be at peace, Vernius? Because we're probably about to make you a little grumpy with us. What do you need? Okay, run, wardens, get back into the get back into the waterland. Out of the desert. Okay, he's gonna make it. He'll be okay. As long as a worm doesn't eat him. He did call a worm to him. Get on the rocks. It's the right move. Okay. He'll make it. Nobody's pillaging these things right now. Five more days. It's all coming together. Diplomatic status improved. Vernius did take the piece. Oh, that's nice, because it gives me all their tech, too. So we got foreman, which is good, but... Um, Probably not something we're going to utilize, really. I did want maybe a research hub back there. I did want uh, military stuff there. Isn't there another good spot for some military men here? <laughs> maybe there will be down here. This guy's research hubs. This guy is statecraft buildings. This guy is economy buildings. No, no good places down there for military stuff. Let's keep making troops, though. Spacing Guild. Oh, I could actually... Never mind. Let's lean into the Arrakis. Lean into the Arrakis. We got two days left on the peaceful annexation plan. Maybe we'll... Maybe we walk guys down there in case we need to get them running. <laughs> the hope is to very quickly build an airfield to support this place. And missile turrets. Landsrad's gonna kick off. These look like they're they're pretty good, 1.5 days. I expect those to complete. I think they're about in this phase where they'll complete before someone can walk in and pillage something. Hmm, 
Phineas, looking uh, looking quite loaded up on the influence here. I imagine Vernius will take themselves propaganda, but I don't think I care too strongly about this. Ekaz gave themselves immunity to that. That's probably not necessary. Nobody's going to put that on you right now, Ekaz, unless they're trying to kill you, and I don't expect they will. We got minor houses happy over here. Well, I am pleased to let this pass. We're, not, we're done with our econ tech at the moment, so we'll happy to let it mess up other people that want it. It does pass. Authority for the smugglers. And this went on the Vernius thanks to the 160 of the minor houses. <laughs> Dick move, minor houses. Did we find another siege way to the east? That's no good. It's too far. Almost here. Almost here. People are going to be... Uh, People are going to be surprised. They're going to be wowed by the strategic brilliance of this. This is fun. Watch this. Watch this. Quick. Missile turret. Missile turret. Missile turret. <laughs> and we've jumped into the hedge lead. We're honored to serve you. I mean, it's not that big of a deal, but it's pretty fun. It's pretty fun. Do you know how miserable it is to attack one town and be shot by the missile turrets of two other towns? Let me tell you, it is miserable. It is an awful, awful thing. We got a good rate. Let's sell some chome here. Let's sell all the chome, actually. We just got to make sure we keep an eye on it. We don't have... um. We could try, well, we're, we're going to peaceful annex way to the east across this desert, see if we could steal this from our Ekaz brethren. They look like, uh, they don't know where they're going at the moment. Maybe they're headed up. I don't know. I'm sure people are somewhat fresh. We definitely stole this field from Vernius. They are not happy about that. Oh, I forgot. I could just be building multiple stuff. I'm the Atreides. I could build whatever I want. Build some some research hub. Let's build some watery stuff. Actually, we've rapidly exhausted our our <laughs> our plascrete. Maybe we go up and we take plascrete's town next. Yes, sir. Um, um. We also hmm. I want to finish out our red here, in case we get embroiled in any difficulties. But, no, cancel, 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 cancel. I, I don't want that. Oh, I, I resolved it before it could cancel it. I wanted to take the money from it, actually. Need to blow something up? Mm, it's hard to even walk out and grab stuff because my water is so low. <laughs> There we go, water extractor. Let's do that. Let's do that. You guys got any wind? This is a four. This guy's a recruitment office guy. Let's do that. What are all these dots? Hostiles near my territory. We salute you. Doghead walking yes, through. Sir. Yes, sir. Scramble the forces. We got lab thopters up though. Where is my okay. lab thopter going? Up there and there. Lab Doctor's got to visit the special regions, so that's where we are sending them. We see a lot of them. And then we can just sort of fly around the darkness afterwards. Let's keep a close eye on these smugglers. He is four snipers, two wreckers. He's got Drisk up. Speaking of Drisk, let's get our boy... You know, we haven't tried Duncan Idaho before. I don't think he's any good. <laughs> Attacks at short range do more damage. Minus speed to enemies in melee. He can go into Berserk mode. Let's get him. Let's get him just to play with him. I think Gurney is the better choice. But that's fine. We can play a little suboptimal because it's a, it's a friendly lobby. Friendly players in it. We're just here to have a good time. Try some stuff out. You know what? As much as I want... 
As much as I want that space and guild, we got to, uh... We got to get some folks in the lands we had. And I'm not even concerned about raiders anymore now that they get the missile rain upon them. Fire the missiles! Ho 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 ho! What do you need? Marvelous. Oh, and the, the Ekaz did take that before we took, we stole it from him. Maybe we'll take the one right above them then? Let's peaceful annex that one. That's got a renegade base in it. What the heck, doghead? Do I got, I got a, I got a blood feud doghead? Is that what you're telling me here? We gotta be in a blood feud? That's what I'm seeing. Pick out the good stuff for the guys. The good stuff for the guys. Um, trying to see what we like. I think I'm fine with these things. Premier units to allied units. Doghead, what does this take here? What does that take, Doghead? Not pleased with that. Oh, this is a spice field. <laughs> Let's get that spice going. You know what we need? We need a. We need a. We need a long time ago. We needed that uh, cheaper buildings option. Here. Maybe we'll do. Uh, we could still do an insulated valley. We've got. Well, yeah, we've got a lot of stuff that could use an insulated valley. Wait, economy's worse right now. Military propaganda first. Proud Liberator, then Insulated Valley. And we continue to prep for war with the dog. Okay, so we are peacefully annexing to our east. Doghead is burning things down in the north. Maybe we'll peacefully annex down here as well. And we're gonna, we want to make sure we're skating underneath the old uh, 20k in the, the hedge count. <clears throat> I wonder if anyone would sell me Plascrete. You think Ekaz or Vernius Feo or R Rice and Beans, maybe they made too much Plascrete and they want to get rid of it? We might take a look. Anyone paying attention is going to put controlled markets on me. Speaking of, oh, look at the spice rates way up. Ekaz bought 7%. Smugglers bought 7%. People are making some money. That's got taint and Ekaz immunity. Ugh. Ugh. Let's, we're voting on the smugglers in that case. Don't put it on me. <laughs> yeah, it's on the smugglers. Good. He gets more pillaging, but he loses his spice rates. There's some. He's not even taking a spice field. There's two spice fields in the back there, and he's not using. We salute you. What do you need? We okay, we've go got a pretty inside. good. We've got a pretty solid force up. We might need we to go you. and try and liberate that once these next two guys get up. Or we could wait the how many days? How many days for ten more days? We could wait 10 more days and make 10 more CP of guys. What do you need? I think maybe we go now while he's he's busy pillaging yes, stuff. Sir. Maybe we we'll claim this territory out Not of the smuggler command. hands. On our way. We'll hold here. Make sure we got Duncan we'll on a number and our ranged guys on a number. Go, Duncan, you lose control of him and he goes what berserk and fights stuff. We'll go, Let's get up there and get rid of this. Get these smugglers out of our lands. Where's our Spice Harvester? That's what we wanted. Okay, the Spice Harvester is up. Good, get to work, Spice Harvester. And this guy... has got his recruitment office. At your command. For Atreides. Let's claim this from the smugglers. And we're gonna ready a decoy thumper. And we're gonna build... in our red slots. And we're gonna keep a close eye out for any. So his army is back here, pillaging that away. We've got our airfield down there. Yeah, I feel pretty pretty good about where we're at at the moment. 
We got this over here. Let's get some cool stuff in there. We can't get cool stuff because we got no plascrete. You can't have stuff when you don't have plascrete. There's smugglers. He's surely counting my troops, trying to figure out if that's the fight he could take. He might run over and try and pillage that to draw me down. We're honored to serve you. Here to deal with the heavy stuff. Yes, sir. All right, let's fight about it. Send, send Duncan Berserk. Get troopers on the snipers. And then the range units focus his free company down. Let me focus snipers after that. Yep, it's looking good. Get off the sands, get off the sands. We did, for some reason, we definitely called the guy off of that space up there that was supposed to be liberate, or supposed to be taking that. Worm struck. Ate our harvester. You get back up there. You get on some lands, Rad. What's going on in the wider world? We're not being murdered by anyone, I hope. We'll go ahead and invest in a little extra plasma over there. You take that, please. What was this? Hero died. Duncan. Oh, it was Duncan Berserk and he chased after them. Oh, <laughs> I forgot about that part. Oh, Duncan's not good, guys. Don't take Duncan. Ugh. 30 lands are at standing. That's a pain. That's a pain and a half. It was a solid fight for us, though. Otherwise... Get some troopers and some heavy weapons. I think we lost maybe a single guy. And Duncan. <laughs> Fucking Duncan. You're out of your element, Duncan. We do need to keep building our main base buildings. I think I think we're gonna do yellow yellow here and then blues over here. Something along those lines. Long. This, this annex takes forever. Oh, is he the forever annexing guy? He might be that guy. He might be that guy. So the uh, there is a counselor for smugglers that says 200% um, longer siege length for your lands that are not surrounded by other lands. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> 200% more siege length. Let's put a thumper on his land over there. Keep him honest. Yeah, get out of here. What's going on down here? Where'd you guys come from? Probably not in my lands. Probably down, yep, down there you came from. That would be nice to have, but it doesn't look like that's in the cards for us. Not a great Paul game. We got kind of screwed on the sieges. Let's prep more thumpers. Someone please murder that free company man. Someone? Murder him, please? Is he gonna get away unmurdered? Ay ay ay. Yeah. That's supremely annoying. What are we taking? What are we building? Over there we're fine. We need our we need building out in our main base. I think we want we got so much spice, we want harvester works is the plan. We're gonna lean into more heavy weapon squads. Heavy weapon squads are my uh, my range unit of choice now that rangers are a lot less exciting. And then we took this place. Let's get uh, our refineries up actually. Change my mind. Canceling you heavy weapon squad. You're gonna spend your life as a support drone actually. Landsrad's coming up. Another three years and we should have this taken. Landsrad. Alright, what do we got in the Landsrad? I've got a decent chunk of influence. Vernius is still sitting on a lot. Ekaz is not pushing 
<clears throat> politics very much at all. So we could we could be would be a, a political Atreides as well. Though I think we're in a pretty good position for hedge. Let's give ourselves a bit of juice on the old Imperial missionaries. And toss one over into the lands of Red Witnesses. No, Vernius decided to finally spend their influence on it. Fair enough. Spice tax. Oh, we weren't paying attention to the spice tax. Gotta keep an eye on that sort of thing. Let's, um... Did this get eaten back here? It must have. My spice harvesters are always getting eaten. This guy's on safe mode. We'll give him more crew. This guy's likely to be sniped by, sni by smugglers any day now. Okay, he'll, he'll get deployed. Let's make another one of them. And um, we're good on the manpower, so we'll get them loaded up there. How are we feeling on authority gains? Feeling good on the authority. What would we sh sh what should we take with it? it? Would have been really funny to have taken that before Ekaz got there, but oh well. I think this is a, a a bit of a bridge too far, but I sort of like getting all up in uh, Doghead's business here. I think this is a maintenance center. Then it's paying out for economy and or statecraft buildings. I guess you could have a wholesale market too. We salute you. And then let's okay. go and fight these renegades and then maybe take this top base. Sir? Just to sort of give us a contiguous uh, borderline there. <clears throat> Our new players. Oh, look, he's expanded up through Doghead's lands. I love that. I love that. Uh, Fail. That's so cool. Doghead is aiming to sit on like a relatively small amount of land. He is um, cooking a little bit with some some passive gain. At your command. So Ready. if he's gonna sit on, on a small moment. amount of land, we you just you. go and uh, go and soak it all it's up behind right him, right? Move. That's very funny. At your command. We'll hold here. At your we could service. use these uh, lands red guard as some Ready. sacrificial lambs to fight this renegade base. Oh, good. We are short on the agents, though. I wonder if we want some spy and logistics. Are you getting that, Vernius? <laughs> Get us some spy and logistics yes, already. Is that guy's not on safe mode yet? Order, sir? All clear. On the move. Put that guy up on safe mode. How's this fight Thank going? You. Just fine, I think. No problems. We did get our proud liber. Insulated valleys coming up. I think we'll go, um, we do want spine. We don't have enough money to buy the patent. We're so poor. We salute you. The These harvesters out and about in the world. Liberate that. We don't have a spacing guild up yet. It's because we're poor currently, so it's holding us back for sure. At your command. We're going to send these Lanzarad guards out to grab Ready some stuff. Received. You guys can go ahead and blow up this town. And we'll take it the old-fashioned way. We're still doing a mighty fine on our authority income, though. Smugglers out there. Causing some smuggler trouble. Data center up in some of these uh, far-out regions in order to suck up some data. <laughs> Don't mind that. Don't mind that. We need a main base build. Let's get Duncan up with the troops. Let's be wary about him getting kited away in the future. We got our insulated valley. That's nice. What are we doing? Spy and logistics is now happening. We do want to... We probably... Mm, we probably want active surveillance. and It's highly likely we're being murdered. Like, right this second, actually. 
Let's, uh, we're gonna move people over to counterintelligence. Month five, it's the month of murdering. To that end, let us, um, invest in... You know what it is. It's the uh, monitoring station to let us see stealth units. These guys are getting raided over to the east. Let's fall back. Airfield, military units, missiles, stealth detection, all that important stuff. Are we gonna win it? We're gonna lose that fight to the east. We're gonna have to head over there. Yes, sir. Do something about it. Well, we'll send just uh, we'll send just Duncan. We'll save on airfield costs. We're listening. Is that where you need us? Harvester's good. What are we building down here? Let's go. Um, the council chamber. I think will be fun. I haven't really played with that yet. So the council chamber is a new one that says um. I'll just show you. If you fail a vote, so you, you get less standing losses, and if you fail a vote, you get half of the influence spent on it back as reimbursement. Isn't that cool? Glad to serve you, reimbursement. Can we send uh, Duncan into a rage here against the, the neutrals? The Duncan's last stand. Tear them apart, Duncan, Idaho. That's funny. What's up uh, with you guys? There, I think that we, we got um, we got the cheaper crews. We definitely want our harvesters okay. all nice and saucy at the moment. Safe mode, pretty please. Lands red. Yep, we're starting to hit our stride. And now, oh, I don't think we have the council chamber up yet, but it doesn't matter because none of this I care strongly about. I do want everyone to have some chome shares. I feel like that would be fair. Wouldn't that be fair if we all had some chome shares? Fifteen percent, fifteen percent, five percent. We do have some choman folks. Um, well, we will absolutely take a fremen sibling, and we'll stick him on counterintelligence. Spacing good. No, we'll go back to Arrakis now that we've got our counterintelligence filled out. And Duncan Idaho can walk home. Good job, Duncan. You murdered some, some innocent raiders. Okay, harvesters. Are all of our harvesters good? 44444, four, 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 all on safe mode. Cool, cool. Let's make sure this guy's got some militia in him and probably. His own personal airfield makes a lot of sense here. What is this? Development patented. Stuff still getting patented out and about in the world. We're not going to get active surveillance. We're actually going to lean back towards the political entente, um, which we're already kind of getting by being friends with them. But um, if it, so this is fun. This is if someone betrays a truce with you, you get five Landsrad guards. And we have got the Lady Jessica for truces, right? You couldn't ask for anything more. I mean, you could ask, but it would be greedy. I think we like uh, maybe another, maybe another data center here. We're about to cap out on influence again. We are making mad influence. I think we want ourselves, let's force everybody into a speaker of the council vote, I think. Is what we'll do. Wait, that says enemy agent captured House Vernius. Verney, Verney, what are you doing, Verney? What are you doing, Verney? Up to no good down there. We will get a listening post there. We need to get our support intelligence. That's our primary sort of military thing. Maybe a supply drop. And we are getting 
pretty loaded up on the authority. So what should we authority? Maybe we'll take this one back here. That's got some extra energy sources for us. And that reminds me, I did want to get support drones up. But I don't have the space for it, do I? Was this guy's paying out for statecraft buildings? Wonderful. Extra resource production with one building of each type. Okay. Have a wholesale market. We are still pretty light in the money. Our stockpile is growing. We are at 17k. Tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna pay this next spice tax. Then we're gonna get rid of our research base. We pay the spice tax. We jump up to 18 in the hegemonies. Let's, we're gonna dump the research center. That pops us back down to 16.7 so we don't look so oogie boogie scary. We got a decent chom number there. That is what we need. We need our uh, we need a chom branch up. Should get that soon enough. Soon enough. Okay, what should the military be doing? Is there stuff out there to grab? I kind of want to research that one and that one. Could grab this and go home. You guys could grab that and that to go home. Feel like we're pretty secure. Doghead doesn't look like he's causing any trouble out there. We do know the Vernians are trying to murder us. So we've got this monitoring station up, so it's at very long range. I gotta be zoomed in here, so. Eh, it's not that long range. It's actually it's in a bad spot. Because we kinda we're with the assassins are probably gonna be coming from the south. Get that chone branch up as ASAP, and then we'll get those other blue things back. I can be a reliable. He wants to ally. give me a harmless gadget. Sure, you're assassinating me, anyways. I'll take a harmless gadget. <clears throat> Could put it in the Landsrad. Makes four influence for me. Ho <laughs> ho, four influence. Absolute power. No, maybe we'll go. Um. No, I'm fine with that actually. Totally fine with that. No, the renegade base ruined that. I guess we're fighting renegades. What jerks. Let's check these front lines. Make sure we got heavy militia out in these places. Boom, boom, boom. And then... We are gonna repurpose yonder data center to a more southerly based uh, monitoring post. Actually, not even there. I like it over here more. We'll put it way up here, which would be a big circle here so we'll see the assassins coming in, right? Maybe the missiles will take them out before they get anywhere. What's going on? Doghead's walking around, causing trouble. He says he's starting to acquire worm sense. Doghead also famous for being worm struck. Okay, yes, so you guys gotta get out there and smash that renegade base. Where are all my troops from? Um, we are capped out on our authority. Let's grab that top authority. Vance says, can you teach me the worm sense? It's a feeling. In your, in your fingers and your toes. Okay. Let's not, uh, let's not get this single guy killed. Is there anything, any shenanigans at foot? Not that I can see out in the world. And we've got our Speaker of the Council up, but we are light on the boats. <laughs> Decline, obviously, that's all right. We do have our council chamber up though, so I dump all my votes into it and um, dump all my votes into it and I'll get half of them back if I don't win. Maybe the new guys don't yet, uh, don't yet know the value of declining things. Maybe the 300 minor houses will take, take, take peace with me. 
or uh, take pity on me and throw me a couple extra votes here or there. Speaker of the Council would be nice to have. Nope. Everybody voted against it except Doghead, who did not put his extra. Dogped gave me gear regs with his extra. And we just got worm struck so bad. I thought we were on the rocks. I thought we were on the rocks. Ugh. I lost my entire cadre of heavy weapons. The rest of these guys will grind it out, but what the fuck? I thought we were fine there. Oh, man. Savage. That's bad. Anyways, back to the blue stuff here. Shit. With the gear regs on me and losing half my army, hopefully nobody's feeling aggressive towards us. Look, we still got that nice big influence bank. We got some of these guys coming up, but we put a... No, I didn't put a missile in there. I put an air base in there. We need to win this fight so we can fly down and save that base. We're actually... I think we're going to opt for the peaceful annex here. Finish it up, finish it up. Because we've got so much uh, influence, we're going to cap out anyways before the next thing happens. Get these support drones. This army's a little weird. we got two unused cap space, but I don't know what to do with it right now. Somebody on the chome. we still got our three guys on counterintelligence. And we're not, we're not researching anything. Veteran? No. Valuable trinkets is what we need up. Then veteran militia. What do we want here? I guess I don't have a space and guild branch, and this is as good a place as any for it. You guys can all fly down there and stomp on those bad, those bad guys. Or maybe they're the good guys and we're the bad guys. You never can quite tell. Doghead sacked that place up there, so we need something else to peacefully annex. Maybe we peacefully annex this little one in between over here. What do you, need? you guys I are fighting, trees. right? Okay. We got... Renegades? Okay. I feel like we should be fine. Again, Vernius attempt on the assassination. We knew it was coming. A2 Vernius. There's the assassin coming in. I feel pretty good that we'll be able to get these cells here. So we did see that assassin walking up thanks to our carefully placed monitoring station. Yes. Listening. At your command. We, we, we spotted it pretty early, too, and we've got three guys on counterintelligence. We should be, should be just fine. Yes. So, it's not the first time I thought I would be just fine. <laughs> and I was wrong. I've been wrong in the past. Oh, I guess we got peace with Doghead somewhere along the way here. Must have been one of those resolutions. Let's go, cell search. Come on in, Mr. Assassin. I don't even want to break the treaty with you. The nice part about uh, searching in the water basin is it's everything's adjacent to it there, so that it's a nice, nice wide net we've cast. Yeah, catching it early was very good for us. We should be A-OK. -okay. Here's another one coming in. There's Mr. Assassin. I think I'm going to catch these before you get up there, Mr. Assassin. Where are you headed to after that? For you, maybe, says Doghead. Okay, we got this cell. We got that one. Cell removed. Cell removed. All right. There could be one here, and there could be ones further back. Maybe we'll check our further back ones first, if he went for the long distance ones. Need to blow something up. Cell search. Go. Nothing was found back there. Need to blow 
blow something up? Let's go. I've been trying to knife him, says House says Fair. <laughs> it's true. There's been some knifings going on. I'm sure there's one here. I sort of suspected there might be ones hidden deeper, but there's not. There's one here for sure. Did we get ones there? Cell switch failed. Cell switch removed, cell removed, cell removed. We've gotten three cells, but you never know with the old, uh, the old Vernians. Smugglers are chomin. I think we're gonna save our money for now. We're honored to serve you. Any orders? I, did, I searched there, so that would have done those three. So I'd need just need to search these ones in the back, and this this spot right here, really. And then we should be all good. Should be all good. We got our base built out. Assassination attempt down to 27%. That's for the best. And there's not one there. Okay. Maybe he doesn't have extra cells up further away. No, he's got at least one more cell somewhere. Cause he, I can tell because he's got two agents on me, which he would not be able to do unless he had cells. Right? 91%, so he did get an, another agent and another assassin in somewhere. We're starting to get slightly more concerned. But we scanned here, we scanned here and here. It's gotta be in the back. It's gotta be a deep set cell, what right? Yes, sir. Heavy weapon at your service. Let's get back and get fl fly over there, guys, so you're ready to search. Starting to get concerned. One more assassin gets in, and we'll be in a bit. We'll be in a bit of a pickle here. Judge of the council, don't mind if I do. Smugglers got. They did capped out again on their 300 influence in between. They must be making a lot, which doesn't surprise me. We vote for ourselves, and give a little bit over here for the minor houses. <clears throat> okay, we gotta get guys over to the east to search those cells. I guess give me judge. And listen to his lies. Give me judge. Punishers for them. Oops, sorry. You guys get up here into the airfield and then fly to the east. Where did that guy get? Where did that assassin get into? Is the real question. We search there, there, there. We search there, there. We search there, 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 there. It's only. It's got to be in the far east, right? Yes. Yep. We are ready. We won't waste time. It's in the east. We are on the move. And that should be that. Ready Unless I'm crazy. Back. Not crazy. We've got the military loaded up in case anyone causes us trouble. What we really want to see is this drop down to just one agent on me, and then the progression factor dip down to nothing, and then we will know we are safe from the murdering. We're going to peacefully annex up here again, if we can get that before Doghead gets there. And we're going to save these close to base ones for maybe an end game grab. Okay, we searched there. Best cell removed. He's down to one agent on me. That should be just about right. I would expect this... He did get another assassin in. Over in the east? Now I'm paranoid. Let's search in the middle again. We searched in the middle. No cells found. Nothing there, there, there. Nothing there, there. Should tick down to nothing now. Maybe he got one last guy in over there in the east before... Before the stuff happened. I think... I think we need our craft workshops up. we're gonna hedge is what we're gonna do 
I don't even care about this anymore because I feel like we I feel like we stopped it. I'm acting as if we stopped it. 55% and ticking down. Right? We've search. searched everywhere a person could search, right? Make sure we got militia up all over the places. Did I, I never built the militia back in that other place, so we gotta fly over there. Fight off these interlopers. Okay, assassination got cancelled. Fair play, Vernius. You gave it a shot. You tried your murdering. That's all right. I don't even... Political Entente was obfuscated. So that is the place where most people keep their three counterintelligence agent. But for the Atreides, it's actually on the far right side. Plus one. Oh, and Vernius declared war on me. Are we fighting Vernius? Are you coming in? Are you threatening me? My Duke. We're honored Vernius to is coming in. So if they engage, we're gonna we're gonna just go land straight on their heads. We're listening. On our way. You guys at the back yes, side, maybe these guys at the front side. Vernius is coming in. Shuttle in right on top of them. Enjoy the triple mil missile turrets, my friends. I suppose I don't even have the uh <laughs> say I don't even have the EMP ready. But I feel like uh our military is gonna chop him up here. As we land in his back his back line there. Oh oh but we don't really want the worm eating us. We'll thump her down in his base. Did the, the worm already struck? What the hell? That was so fast, you fucking worm ate half my army. I, I thumpered like as soon as worm sign showed up and he still struck. Oh my god, that was some... Mm. That was frustrating. It's frustrating to do the appropriate counterplay and have it not do any, not not work because the worm struck in like three seconds. I'm a little grumpy about that. I killed Duncan again too. God damn it, Duncan! Wardens, the eight supply drone support drones. Requires mechanization. I can't make any more support drones. Come on, Vernius. There's no need to be. There's no need to be like this. We could be friends. But more importantly, are my craft workshops working? Special, special. And then I don't have any other specials. Is that true? Light on the specials. So that's all. So, doghead's gonna beat me. Doghead's cooking. Plus 56 on um, the smugglers. Be mean to them. We're honored to serve you, my duke. We'll go, sir. I'm still mad about that worm strike. That is way too many missile turrets you got there. You are correct, my friend. That is why I took this. For for the too many missile turrets option. Yes, we will hawk some influence to the guild in order to get a spaceship. Or a, a, rather, a backup spaceship on deck. Extra rangers. I do want a support drone. It's gonna be a while. <laughs> it's gonna be a while till we get the mechanization. My support Let's be friends great. again. Hey, I can't for another half a day because you broke a truce with me. So, we'll see what the Lanzard has to say. Anybody want to be a water seller? Get rid of some of these. This is development obfuscated. Hero died from worms, of course. No one's actually like beating Duncan in man on man combat. <laughs> the smugglers have a bounty on themselves. Mm, I'm tempted to vote for smugglers. Take that cash, I guess.
Yeah, I, I don't think I have quite enough to, to force it on me. I'll just take the 30,000 Solari. We salute you. Yes, sir. Okay, so I have space for five. Five is probably an additional trooper. What do you need? Send those Lanzarat out first and go fight those renegades over there. I have been lax on um, investigating those crashed shuttles. 140 for a truce. Is this, is this expensive? Oh, it's expensive because we were recently at war? I'm not even trying to force it on him. I just want to offer a peace treaty with him. We are doing just fine. I think maybe we'll do a bit more on the we'll do a bit more on the stockpiling. Let's build ourselves up a nice fat bank. Boy, it's expensive. Why is that so expensive to buy stuff right now? Everyone did everyone just buy up instantly? Ecas and smugglers are both contesting it. That's fascinating. Okay, get off the sand. Oh my god, these worm strikes are Fast! It, it just, just gave me the notification, and then the guy died before I could even micro him off the sand. This is ridiculous. These worms are out for blood today. Outrageous. I guess, uh, that was a ranger, wasn't he? Can everyone <laughs> jump into the Kraken? How many can you hold? The rest of you gotta walk, sorry. We did get this place way up here. Let's build out with some stuff. Missile stuff, fighty stuff. Maybe some data centery stuff. He doesn't really get any good benefits of, of things, so I guess we'll just do a listening post there. Makes as much sense as anywhere. Are there any more tech things to be grabbed out and about in the world? Peaceful things to be annexed out and about in the world. We'll pull peaceful annex Doghead Spicefield back there. <laughs> that will make me that will make me laugh at the very least. I don't know if anybody there will actually survive, but I find it very funny just to even think about. Okay. Let's get our control group going here. Duncan the third or the fourth or something is back. So the good news about Duncan is every time he dies, Gola Wisdom, he gets a buff to his last stand ability, which is sort of hilarious. Oh my god, and we still have never, we still have never rebuilt these militia, so we keep losing this place. Okay, let's so rebuild those militia. We gotta make sure we are taking advantage of building stuff, not getting capped out. Making stuff and things. Airfield, do, does, what else do I want back there? Maybe another recruitment office, just in case. Spend $5,000 on Chome, why not? What do you, need? you guys can just sit back there for the moment. I don't love this plus 16 versus plus 58. That's not a good, it's not a good trade-off there. Plus 58, he's gonna he's gonna hedge ahead of me. I think I need to just straight up war on him again. Probably in the north. We're to serve I think you. we war on those guys. I could buy a hawk. <laughs> just have a random hawk flying around. Minus damage received from Granius. I don't think I've, I haven't used a hawk because they seem like they got nerfed quite a bit. We're about to get veteran militia up. That's great. Then mechanization. Is there anything else I care about? I care about not losing the hedge race to goddamn doghead. That's also not great that both the other players are just like sitting their full armies right on the border with me. <laughs> it's, like, it's not a good sign. And then I'm like, I should go fight this other guy. Oh dear. Oh dear. But I, really though, I should go fight him. 371 to annex that if I wanted to. 
We're peacefully taking that in the back. I think if or when he goes to cause trouble back here, maybe that's when I fly up and, and, and try for the try for the, the, the space wreck on him. Does that have an airfield on it? It does not have an airfield on it. That's kind of interesting. Let's, um... Administrative burden. Let's get an EMP bomb in the works. You know why. EMP bomb. Minus 50% power and speed to mechanical units. We salute you. And we got a handful of mechanical units around these days. Vernius, should we be, shouldn't we be friends? Shouldn't we live in peace and harmony? And you give me all of your technology, Vernius. Yes, they agree. Of course. I can be a reliable ally. They may well be trying to murder me again as we speak. That's fine though. I accept that part of our friendship. Ready. Truce ended. Smugglers have ended a truce with me. Oh, they're coming up. Okay, I thought they might. Two people at 30 plus chome. It's true. What are you up to, doghead? We're blocking each other from winning it. It's true, I like that. I like that you're blocking each other from winning it. Looks like Doghead may have noticed and is now walking over. <clears throat> Loss of rights. Boy, wouldn't it be nice if I was the Speaker of the Council. <sighs> Eye of the Council. Tax negotiations. We're, t Ooh, we're low on the influence, but what can you do? I guess the smugglers could beat me for anything. The smugglers will probably vote up. No, they still want their water sellers union, though. All factions get cheaper upkeep. I think we'll try for the Eye of the Council. If loss of rights goes through, we'll lose the judge, but we'll get the Eye. Fair trade. Let's see what we got. Let's see how it rolls. Only other person up is Ekaz. Smugglers could vote Ekaz in ahead of me. Oh, I guess Ekaz have like 20 more votes because they went for the triple blue building, so they've got 200 main votes. Smugglers got it. They voted themselves. I didn't even think they were eligible. Well, maybe I was looking at the wrong one. We'll make you proud. It's the right Let's get to marching, boys. Talkhead's over there causing trouble. Let's go cause trouble with Doghead. We're honored to serve you. Why are there worms coming again? No, he's thumpered a bit. I don't want to be wormed. Right I just I'm gun shy from being overly wormed. He is smashing my buildings. We're honored to serve you. Damn worms. We salute you. What do you need? Yes, sir. Do you need the Kraken? Where's my Kraken at? Get up there, Kraken. What are you doing back home? The laziest Kraken I know. What should I be grabbing? Maybe we'll reveal we another siege. Let's get to walk in. You, Let's go we'll fight these smugglers. We'll he is walking off of this. I don't know if he intended to do that. Oh, he's getting raided in his front lines, too. Your it's the right Please don't eat me, worms. Yes, sir. Let me get onto the rocks. We'll Please don't sir. eat me, worms. We'll hold here. We'll make you proud. Okay. Successfully got in there. Unless, oh, there must be a stealth guy on that, holding it up. We salute you. We're honored to serve you. Doghead coming to cause it's trouble. Right we'll hold here. It's our duty. We salute you. At your command. 
Glad to serve you, my Duke. I understand, sir. You. No, you guys gotta get back there. At least one of you gotta stay behind. I'm at your service, sire. Capping that. Hold your ground. Everybody else, fight. Fight Doghead, please, not the Raiders. You wanna focus? Snipers, always. I feel like it's going pretty well-ish. Ooh, Worm ate some of his guys. I think they got his hero. Or Rage Duncan. We'll build some reinforcements. A lot going on here. We're honored to serve you. We'll do it for you, sir. Oh, supplies. Oof. My Duke. We're honored to serve you. Alright, we a, def uh, a definitive battle won against the perfidious smugglers. My Duke. On our way. Duncan, go ahead and uh Finish grabbing that point of interest. Somehow we grab, we research that. <laughs> All clear. Waiting for your order. Okay, let's go. Oh, uh, that got cleared back there. This is gonna take us th 13 years to clear. So we need a frontline rally point. We need more troopers because that's how we deal with Not the yet. dirty we smuggles. You guys all fall back to a safe zone. You reinforcements get out there. Get the Kraken up there. Cuts down on upkeep, he says. <laughs> Closer to the light of the chome. Alright, we got a good we got a good amount to sell. Let's make sure oh. 33, 34. People, these I am I am thankful for the ECAS. Evil dog heads, liberating the evil dog heads lands. I am thankful for the uh, the ECAS for keeping that chome fight so uh, so close. We're honored to serve you. Well, we gotta unload this support drone. Service, Isn't that cool? Your support drones grab your guys before they die. You gotta remember to unload them to heal them up, though. Pure evil. Yes, ready. evil. Um, the other lands look good. I think we're gonna lean into border defenses. Do I have enough to grab? I am light on the authority. We need a bunch more authority still before we could be too, too evil. So let's buy this water one. Let's buy this water one to get us authority. Was there any other authority options to buy around the place? could swear they were. We'll buy this guy for some influence. That's looking good. Doghead has ceded that territory. I guess GG, Dog Doghead. It's looking good. We shall see. We shall see. Yeah, so our, our new players are being a bit passive. What you want to be doing is you want to, when, when you're in the late game and you're not really sure what to do, you keep an eye on the map, and if you see, like, oh, green, I mean, these things pop up for everybody to see, even if it's Fog of War. You're like, oh, green is annexing this, and, you, you know, Darkhead and, and Daylock are talking shit to each other. You could expect us to be in a fight, so that's your chance to go and, you know, steal some of their, uh, steal some of their borderlands. I think maybe we do lean in towards a hedge boom now. 10 days on the Imperial tax. Let's do so. We'll dump the lands red standing and we'll start the research center. It's the right move. What is this? This is a normal fight, but the missiles, the missiles. All factions suffer cancel current assassination attempts. I think I'm putting my votes on that. <laughs> I don't need assassins mucking up this this final hour here. Uh, it did sound like Vernius was trying to assassinate Ekaz. Um, which, you know, actually, I don't want that to happen because Ekaz is holding half of the chome stock. If they die, smugglers buy it all up. So we are going to support 
smugglers are opposing that. We are going to support that to try to cancel assassination attempts. That's interesting that you put the, the bounty on it, though. Uh, it might not work, then. It might not work. We'll see. We'll try and get it opposed. We got a lot of guys on counterintelligence. We're pretty safe from it. I feel like we're in a good spot for a hedge boom towards victory. Opposed. Okay. Atreides will sneak speaker here. I did not sneak speaker. Look at me. But I am getting invaded by the foul, perfidious Verniuses. They're getting wrecked, though. <laughs> oh, they're invading while the militia are attacking the raiders. That's funny. Very funny. Let's drop some. Let's drop some stuff. I think this is an easy win here. Is Duncan still alive? Duncan, go berserk. Anyone with uh, ability to focus fire. Vernius is assassinating me. Let's get some some searching done. Oh no, doghead! He's caught up the kraken, not the kraken. Focus fire to get down the weak guys. Oh, we need to stop this healing. Kill that lady for sure. Should have been watching that earlier. We did lose the Kraken. Let's make it... One. We've lost one Kraken. Yeah, so what about second Kraken? Did that get liberated by rebels? That's very funny if it did. All good. So far, zero casualties, thanks to our drones. And then we unload the drones and we let everybody heal up. Zero casualty fight. The strength of the Atreides. Valuing their life of their, their people. And all he did was really destroy a missile turret. You can't fight into triple missile turrets. It's impressive. Oh, we need you to heal up all the Atreides, because we got it. Round two up there. Start a peaceful annex there. Not enough for that one. We salute you. What do you need? Ooh, do we jump right on top of them? I guess we do. Into the wraith. My duke. We salute you. Must be an airfield range. We'll this guy was out of airfield range. Drop some orders in here. Trust me, I'm aware, he says. There's Duncan in here. Duncan, go nuts! Who's fighting me now? Ekaz is hitting me on the east. They're doing it, they're all doing it. We boomed too soon. Just as we always do. You wouldn't want it to be too easy, boys. Get the rally point up here. Get that guy over there. Did we kill the Wraith? Is it dead? <laughs> Set this guy back. Get some troopers. Ekaz are taking that. Oh, we're at 29. We're so close. Were we annexing this one? We're annexing this one. Will that be get done? It might get done. Never mind. We're walking back to try and slow that steel down. Hmm. It's, we're very close, actually. We can't get up to 10%. It's $10,000. Fuck it. We're buying $10,000 chum. Oh, the the the, the the main airship came in right there. Okay, so we need to be able to uh, fight for this stuff. Still need a rally point there. We are ready. Awaiting command. The crew is ready 
to serve, sir. We're just gonna make like straight troopers. That I think is gonna get liberated before this finishes. It's gonna be close. Buying time up here. No, we might actually annex that. That might be a win. It'll be within like a hundred points or something. It'll be so, so close. Yes, sir. With honor. We're gonna lose up there. I think we'll finish our annex. It's not gonna be enough. Annex first. 29.8 and then we lost it. Oh, we were 200 short. 200 short. Arg. Vernius is going to murder me because I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> GG, guys. Yes, we made it to 29,800. Uh, yeah, it wasn't my hardest attempt, right? Because we got some new guys, so I could have been a little more cagey and, 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 and held off, but uh, that was fun. We'll let them play it out now. They get to deal with Doghead. I had a good time. Uh, 29-8. I think Atreides is real strong, right? We won most of the fights. The only reason we really, I think we lost that last fight against uh, um, the smugglers in the north was because we just flew everyone in underneath uh, the Wraith, the big smuggler ship that does the big AoE damage. That one's super dangerous in a big blob fight like that, and we still almost got all of those smugglers out of the way. Um, it was really, uh, you know, it was a question of a couple days there. We could have, we probably could have taken something else in between, or we could have held someone off if we hadn't gotten, gotten in fights everywhere. Uh, we did get distracted at the end. I, I, I did forget that that assassin was ticking. Um, but I, I had lost that region there. I was about to lose my northern region. So the hedge victory was not nigh for me. It would have been a longer game to climb back into. Um, I had a good time. That was fun. That was a fun show with Avernius. I don't even mind that I died. I feel good for the new guys. They have managed to take down the Titan, and they get to uh, square off with Doghead. Hopefully, Vernius and the Ekaz are able to reach some sort of uh, accord there, and then uh, go fight Doghead because he's he'll be the villain. He's gonna be uh, he's gonna be maxing out his hedge there real soon. Let's look at where we were when we were, when we ended. Thirty one percent for the Smugglers, thirty four for the Ekaz. Both of them were pretty rich. We're lucky that they were contesting each other. I was rich. I'm sitting on thirty five k. I wasn't even spending it because the chone was so expensive. Development and knowledge is always the uh, the Vernius game. Hardly even bears looking at here. Solari production. Look at the money Ecaz is making. It's at one point they cap out at fourteen hundred income. I'm actually making just about as much as the smugglers for much of the game here. Why did I bottom out at nothing? I don't know why that happened, but money stocks. I'm just sitting on my stockpile of money. Ecaz is spending every dime they got. Yeah, people were pretty pretty economically wealthy. Chome shares, yeah, again, that was definitely what uh, Doghead was leaning towards. Um, and Ekaz were keeping him honest there. And then he was trying to go for hedge, so I was keeping him busy on the hedge, the hedge game. Regions. Yep, yeah, Regions is usually an Atreides game. I'll tell you, we got kind of screwed by only having one Siege to ally with. You certainly want at least two or more with the young Paul Atreides. That would have given us a, a, a extra sauced up authority income. We felt pretty good in authority, but uh, uh, one Siege is not enough. Vernius had more Siege alliances than we did. Unacceptable. Politics. We were do. We were sort of the premier standing. I guess Dog had caught up at the end. That's usually the nature of things. Smugglers start politics really slow, but they get a stacking, um, uh, they get a stacking influence income from paying their spice tax, so they can really contest politics stuff at the end of the game. Intel production was all Vernius. That's a Vernius game there. Command points. We were all pretty close, and then I jumped up, and this was, uh, so this would have been when I, f I jumped up ahead to 55. This would have been when we fought Doghead. He took some heavy losses there in the desert, and then I managed to take that little Plaskrete region that he took above me. Fought with Doghead. Maybe I fought with Doghead somewhere. Somewhere we fought with Doghead around here. Looks 
Duncan was killed by the smugglers. Drisk killed by the locals. Nuwa killed by the locals. Nuwa killed by the locals. Whitmore killed by the locals. What's going on? Who are these locals? I killed Drisk. Nuwa was killed by me. <laughs> it's funny how many kills the locals got there. Um, yeah, not a lot to say about command points. Nobody took any base damage. That was a fun game. I'm going to consider it a win because I hit... 29,800. That's a win in my book. It's close enough. <laughs> Hope those guys have fun with it. Hope you guys had fun watching this. That's an Atreides game. I feel like the Atreides are pretty good these days. Um, I think you can you can kind of push Gov a little bit. You can push Hedge real well. Um, and your armies are pretty tough. You can do you could do some pretty good fighting. Uh, and we had good economy too. I mean, we're sitting on 36,000 dollars, 36,000 Solari here. We got nothing to do. We got a maxed out stockpile. I mean, I feel like uh, Atreides are a bit of a jack of all trades and uh, better than average at most of them as well, right? Pretty solid. Thanks for watching, guys. We will have more Dune Spice Wars coming throughout the week. See you around.